Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another reaction video and this time I'm taking a look at the developer update for Wrecking Ball and I can't wait until our boy Jeff tells us all about our boy Wrecking Ball um, and I might actually check out some gameplay after this too because I think there's some gameplay somewhere I, at least I assume because most of the time when they announce a character someone has gameplay somewhere so i'm gonna look after this i'm not exactly sure and i, I want to keep myself surprised because i didn't want to look up gameplay and have anything spoiled to me so that's why i didn't do it ahead of time um because I, I want i want jeff to tell me what's up with this character first because i love this boy jeff all right it better be jeff by the way if it's not i'm gonna turn this fucking video off and if it's someone else with jeff i'm gonna shut it off so more all right good Hero 28 Lucky. is rolling into the lineup in today's developer update <laughs> from the Overwatch team. Jeff, you're funny. I'm very excited to introduce I can tell. Wrecking Ball. Now, you might be wondering who Wrecking Ball is, so we should talk a about the like a Wrecking a little bit. Ball. So, on the Horizon Lunar Colony, we already know that yeah. experimentation was happening with animals, which <clears> led <throat> to our favorite talking gorilla, Winston being oh. not only highly intelligent Sorry. but able to communicate Harambe? with us human they're, beings. Everybody calls him Harambe. The they Lol. were doing experimentation with other animals as well. And Hammond, who is a hamster, ended up growing <laughs> not so only proud quite of... large but also gained Hammond, a lot of who's a hamster? himself. Now, when the Get apes it? of the lunar colony went crazy and revolted and attacked the scientists there... We know that Winston escaped, but what we're going to learn is that Hammond Rise took of the a ride in an escape pod the along apes. with Winston off of the moon. Now, as they were hurling a towards realism. planet Earth, Hammond's pod broke off and landed in a different location. We know that Winston ended up landing at Watch Point Gibraltar, where he sort of set up his home base. But Hammond landed on the outskirts junker town in australia <clears throat> now while this might have been an overwhelming challenge to some hammond really embraced the moment and he took it as an opportunity to modify his escape pod into a devastating mech yeah now, he modified the shit out of it town knew that hammond was actually a hamster and he oh, okay, because he was just rolling around. I just thought he was a robot. All right. For some time, actually, just like we thought. Numerous we thought he was just a robot. Unbeknownst to anybody that he was actually a hamster. And they just knew him as Wrecking Ball, this devastating force that could win the gladiatorial combat over and over Damn, again. Damn, see his hands? Now, Hammond is not a junker and not part of the junkers. Jeff gets he into it. He had a it. lot of fun winning their championship over and over again. And he uses mechanical skills to really modify that escape pod. But now he's moved mm. on and he's sort of wandering the planet um, doing fun things. Now, there's certain things I should clarify fun for things. you. Hammond cannot talk. He does not speak English yeah, or figured. any other language. That would be completely ridiculous. I wonder who voices him, though. Know. However, probably the Fred Mac, which he highly modified has communication abilities. Oh, really? So he can speak in essence oh. through the Mac. The mech itself has a minor AI in it that can also communicate. So oh, that's cool. The mech so you is can actually, mech, all right. And so you can have Hammond voice lines for not much. a junker. These are the most important things. For I thought it'd be like Bastion where background you just say backstory. random shit like. Hey, 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 hey. Also, uh, good friends with that's Winston. That's how hamsters talk, right? Able to communicate to each other, uh, but Winston is not yet aware that Hammond has made his way back to the planet. So that's going to be a bit of a surprise for everybody. Now, what you're oh. all wondering is. What are Wrecking Ball's abilities? Wrecking Ball is a tank. I think he's one of the funnest tank characters we've ever added to Overwatch. Okay. The primary thing that he can do is shift into ball mode. So not only can he be a quadruped tank shooting his quad cannons. But he can get really somewhere really quick. Oh, that's high good. Rate of fire, that's high good. Spread, oh, we um, need that. Big impact guns that he has. But he can switch into ball mode and then roll around with devastating impact. Now, while in ball mode, he has a grappling crawl, uh, grappling hook that he can shoot grappling out claw. and okay. grasp onto things that allows all him right. to swing all over the place and really gain a lot of momentum. So he actually For turns a into a real wrecking ball. Player, That's actually awesome. Find a lot of nuance. That's funny. And fun. In oh my god. That's gonna be nuts. That oh. Really gets you into all sorts oh my of god. 
I can't wait to play a whole a whole arcade game with just all wrecking balls. That's gonna be insane. It's gonna be giant balls swinging from roofs trying to hit each other. Oh, I can't wait. That's gonna be fun. It's kind of like how Brigette. It was actually a lot of fun yeah, to play against six really Brigettes until and they were losing, and then they ch- decided to switch to other, other characters character. like a bunch of pussies. It will cause wrecking balls uh. to go into his pile driver move. Which I'll be in my main so we can win now. Oh, fuck you. Speed, and Just because you're not good at the yet. Damage. He also has an Wait, actually, go back. shield ability because he's Just a real quick. Earth cause wrecking ball to go into his pile driver move, which sends him hurtling Just, towards yeah. Earth at a rapid speed and also doing a lot of devastating damage. He also has like an adaptive guy. shield ability because he's a tank. And the way this works is... If you just press the adaptive shield, you'll gain a minimum amount of shields every single time. Oh, sorry. But if you do the adaptive no. shield while you're surrounded by more enemies, you gain even more shields. So this really encourages so it's kind of like Brigitte to get kinda? into the fray, get into the middle of the enemy team, uh, and then no. use that adaptive shield to be highly disruptive. Now, his ultimate is a lot of fun. It's what we call a zoning ability, okay. and it's minefield. So oh, when okay. Wrecking Ball presses his ultimate, it deploys a number of mines out in the area. They take a little while to arm, which gives people some time to get out of the way. They're very visible and very audible to the enemy team. But if the enemy team steps into the minefield, well, dev- devastating explosions happen. <laughs> now the intention Devastate. for Wrecking Dev- Ball is for him explosions to be a very disruptive, happen. high mobility tank. And we think he's a ton of fun to play. We know that we have a lot of tank players, and we also have a lot of. I move my hands a lot too. Haven't so quite I can't found even. the tank for them yet. So we're hoping that Wrecking Ball brings a new element. We also know how much you like our Horizon Lunar Colony lore and the story oh, going okay. on. Okay, I thought say map because I do not like that map. You to more characters from the Horizon Lunar Colony, <laughs> plus with his stint amongst okay. the Junkers. Cool. He also brings in a little bit of that Junker flair that we hear uh, that you guys like so much. So all in all, we feel like Wrecking Ball is a great addition to the Overwatch lineup. He's really something different. He's really out there. We think you'll have a ton of fun playing him, and we're really looking forward to all the great things that you're going to do playing Wrecking Ball. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. He looks kind of cool. Go. I sneezed. Look at that chubby face. All right, hold on. I'm gonna look up some gameplay right now. All right, so he seems like he's definitely a very much a tank character. I like I like his ultimate. The way they make it sound sounds pretty dope. Wrecking Ball gameplay. Let's see, I'm sure so, it's like on the PTR somewhere, right? Gameplay here we go. All right. All right, so we're gonna watch this. Uh, I'll put the audio off because I'm sure it's gonna be some guy who goes, "Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, uh, Major." dick and i'm here to tell you all about oh there you go there he is look at that. uh ph hammond <laughs> is an intelligent genetically engineered hamster who is searching for adventure while piloting a battle meg known as wrecking ball okay all right I'll turn him off completely um all right there he is oh that's oh uh, uh, look at him it looks cool i wonder all right he has no skins yet he has nothing yet so far because you know he's brand new PTR, they don't usually give you anything to begin with. And then they slowly start dishing stuff out. Um, but that's cool. Might as well, yeah, look at the heroic stuff. I want to, oh, all right, well, fuck it then. Oh, he went back. Okay, oh, okay, what, 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 Jesus. Calm down, bro. It'll be fine. It's okay. All right. All right, so here we go. Uh, here, that's your grappling hook is your right, um, mouse button. I play on consoles, so. Uh, all right. Well, I watch him do this stuff. Okay. So, what's your regular fire? Is it just like it's probably just? The, I'm assuming just the guns, obviously. Um, what is he doing? Okay. All right. Well, they look like they do pretty good damage, and they look like uh, they don't have much of a spread. Well, that looks nice. That feels nice. I'm not even playing. That feels nice. Okay. Okay. Let's uh jump around all right yeah shooting looks like when you shoot you build up your uh ult really quickly but that might just be practice range i'm not sure i don't really use practice range too much 
Yeah, no, that has to be practice range. That's way too quick. You saw that? He shot a little bit and went up 10%. Like a little bit and went up. All right, so here's the ball mode. That's really cool. Do you go really fast, though? Because that might be really useful when you need to get on a point. He's not going to. All right, wait. I, 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 go back. Go back, fucker. All right. No! Come on. God. Oh, God. I got to, like, crossfade. There we go. All right, so quad cannons. That's his regular weapons, obviously. Minefield deploy a massive field of proximity mines. Okay, cool. I wonder how long they stay on the map. Oh, his difficulty is three, by the way. Um, I wonder how long he stays on uh, the uh, mine stay on the field uh, until someone triggers him. Uh, grappling claw, launch a grappling claw to rapidly swing around the area. It enables high speed collisions to damage and knock back enemies. That's gonna be. I can already predict there's gonna be achievement or uh, a trophy or whatever. That's like knock back. I mean, knock three enemies off the map or something with a uh, grappling claw. Mm. All right, roll, transform into a ball, increase maximum movement speed. All right, good. I was hoping. I'm sure Jeff said that too. I just didn't hear it. Uh, pile driver slam into the ground below to damage and launch enemies upward. Cool. Uh, create temporary personal shields. Amount increases with more enemies nearby. Okay. So everything else I did here. Um, okay. Wait, wait, all right. I know it's your first time playing, dude, but come on, do, do, do the moves. I, I, I know you want to show off the stuff. Like it's really fast. Look at it; it's real fast. But I, I, I want to get to the good stuff. That ball is pretty cool. All right, here we go. All right, well he fucked it up. <laughs> yeah, attach it to like the bridge. That makes more sense to me. Okay, let me see what he's saying. Let me just skip along. All right, I probably skipped him doing it, didn't I? Yeah, yeah he just did it there. Did he? I don't know. I can't tell. Oh, there's the pile driver. That looks pretty. That looks pretty. That looks pretty good. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what's wrong with me today. I got like a brain problem today. I apologize. Oh, oh, oh! He almost went off the map. Oh, that's kind of cool. You can knock, you can knock him up, and then I don't know. I don't know what you can do with him up there. I guess shoot him. <laughs> I don't know. It's cool though. Visually, it's cool. See the grappling hook if they. If this guy showed it yet. I don't think he did. I think he used it once and then said screw it. Alright, so that's your shield, and, and once you're near more enemies, you actually get more of a shield. I wonder how far it will go up. Alright, so it looks like you got a hundred shield right there, just because there's an enemy nearby. Because he has regularly 600. Join some assholes group? No. Please don't. <laughs> Alright. Come on. Is, is he... Alright, there you go. Oh, he doesn't know how to use it. Oh, oh, there's the mines! Oh, those are so obvious, though. Can you shoot them, too? I wonder if you could, like, shoot them. Just... I, you know what? I can already see a feral ult being really good here. <laughs> like, just... Or, or even a Reinhardt ult. If you could destroy them. I'm not sure if you can. Uh, I'm sure you can, like, trigger them by shooting them. Um, but I could see them like just clearing this out of the way, a fair old, or just like, even like a regular person's, um, a regular person, uh, like a regular, like soldier gun, you know, just uses regular gun or even diva. Um, unless maybe they might take a lot of damage to the story. I'm not really sure. Uh, and I'm not even sure, but you might to be able to destroy one and it explodes and then all the other ones explode. If that's the case, this ult isn't going to be as useful as I hoped. All right, so there's the shield. And because you, he's near three people, he got 300 shield. That's insane. So if you're... Holy fuck. So if you're going after the point... So this is like the perfect character to just keep all, keep a um, hold of the payload. Because if there's like six dudes there and you use that for like seven seconds, you're going to have like seven, uh, 600, um, 600 um, extra armor. So that's going to be insane. So you have 1,200, and you can still shoot and use your abilities, and, and you know, six seconds might be long enough for someone to show up and help you. So that, and he might be a really good character just to keep a point. But, um, all right, looks cool. There's a guy, there's a guy he's swinging around. Can't get much from the swinging on this map, I feel like. Because even with the other bridges and stuff, the bridges are way too low to the ground. That's kind of cool, where you can, like swing around a corner and stuff 
maybe not even to uh, attack someone, just to maybe even surprise them by just swinging up in the air and starting attacking them or something. Ooh, that's nice. Oh, and there you go. Yeah, this guy's gonna be tricky to uh, play with. He's not. He's definitely not gonna be someone you immediately get. But uh, I'm excited to play as him. So anyway, there you go. That is Wrecking Ball. I'm very excited to play my boy. And uh, there you go. So that's the gameplay and that's the um, developer update. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. And until next time, of course, goodbye.